Hi, this is Mitch Mitchell. This is my first video of 2015, and it's a new year, so of course that means I have some goals for the year. I can't say that they're necessarily new goals. I think some of them are the same types of goals I've had, but I've modified them some. For instance, I've determined this year that whatever it takes, I'm going to make sure that I don't make myself depressed. So in other words, I want to try to make myself happier. So one of the things I've already done is I basically stopped receiving a lot of news alerts. I was receiving the local news alerts and CNN news alerts and New York Times news alerts, and I was receiving all of these on my phone. So I have eliminated all of those except for local weather because I live in central New York and we need to know what the weather is uh, before we go out in it. Like, for instance, right now it's below zero outside uh, as I'm doing this. I'm doing this... I guess you'd say early morning as opposed to late at night. So, <laughs> but, you know, I'm getting rid of a lot of that stuff because, you know, I could be in almost any place and I get a news alert and I look at it. If it's something really depressing, I may not be in a place where I want to be depressed at that moment. So I just decided, you know what, I'm going to cut down on a lot of that stuff. Uh, and I'm also going to watch some of the other news alerts. You know, if there's certain stories that I know already it's going to make me mad, I'm not reading them. So I decided that's going to be a thing. I've decided that this is the year that I need to move away from just being the type of consultant that I've been. Basically, I've been more of an interim, go save people consultant, which in essence is a part-time job. And I don't really like that part of things. You know, I mean, I spent 18 months in Memphis, and although it wasn't the worst thing in the world, in essence, it was an interim part-time job. It's a job I get paid well for, but it's time to move beyond that. I've been in business almost 14 years now. So I've got some goals on that, you know, wavelength also. And, you know, I just want to be more productive. I got to get that second book out this year. I've got some people reading it. Matter of fact, I have to contact all those people because I actually told them I wanted it back by the beginning of the year. And I gave them six weeks and now they've had eight weeks. So I guess I have to contact those people. So, like I said, I've got some goals. I have some video goals for this year. Uh, the last video was an interview, so I was able to get that interview. And one of the funniest things is that I've got a new old camera that I'm using. And the reason I say it that way is because I did the last interview um, as a Google Hangout, of course, because that's the way I prefer to do them. And I wasn't late. I just couldn't get the camera working. And so I grabbed the laptop real quick, and I put the camera on top of that, and I did it from the laptop, which wasn't bad. But after that was done, I spent six hours trying to figure out what was wrong with the software. I had had some computer problems, so I spent time working on the computer. And then after six hours or so, I said, hey, what if the problem is the camera? <laughs> The problem was the camera. The camera had burned out. The camera defunct. The camera quit. It died. It freaked. It was no more. So this is my other camera, which is the one that I always carried with me when I went out of town for the laptop. This is now the main camera. I'm going to have to get a new camera to travel with, or maybe I get a new camera that I'll keep home. I need to think about one of those traveling cameras, you know, that people walk around with outside. This one has to be attached to the computer for it to work. So if I'm going to take that next step up, I might have to think about that. Maybe I'll get a GoPro. I didn't even know what a GoPro was until just before Christmas when I happened to be at the mall. Um, I'm in Syracuse. Let's see, what do we call it? Destiny now? We call it Destiny. <laughs> It used to be called Carousel. It was Carousel for like 23 years, and now suddenly it's Destiny. Anyway, we've got a new Microsoft store. So I happen to be walking in there looking around at stuff. Lo and behold, we have a GoPro. I had no clue what it was. I'd seen the commercials on TV. It never occurred to me what it was. So maybe one of those. We shall see. So anyway, that's you know a little quick update. We're going to have a lot of fun this year. And we're going to start off the fun with this. You probably saw it in the picture. Let me get it real close to you. Look at this. Reese's Spreads Peanut Butter Chocolate. I saw this in Wegmans tonight, and I said, oh, I've got to buy that. Got to try that. And decided I was going to try it live. So, see, it has not been opened. So we're going to open this bad boy right now. You're going to see the live reaction. See, it has not been opened. So taking the top off. And I'm one of those anal type guys, so I have to make sure that all this stuff is off. All this paper. You can't have anything hanging over it. 
Because if I like it, then I'll probably be eating it on stuff. If I don't like it, it's not really going to matter because I'll just throw it away. So there you go. That's what the inside of it looks like. <sighs> smells good. <laughs> Got my spoon. I'm not going to eat a bunch of this. I just want to taste it. And if I like it, then when I wake up, this might be breakfast, lunch, and dinner tomorrow. Here we go. Oh no. Okay, this is good. Oh my goodness. Mm. You know what, you Reese's people? You got a good one here. I didn't like your Reese's peanut butter. It didn't taste like the peanut butter in the peanut butter cup. Didn't like it. This is wonderful. Oh my goodness. I don't have anything to eat it on. I guess I could get some cookies, but you know what? I'm just going to leave that to jar. And. You know I'm doing the My Fitness Pal thing. You know my glucose has been under control. But I'm um, looking at this bad boy here. What does it say? Two tablespoons. Tablespoons are 190 calories. These are teaspoons. But I've only basically I had the tip. So I didn't even have a full teaspoon yet. How many teaspoons in a tablespoon? I'm going to have to find that out. Still, I'm going to enjoy this. So there you go. Reese's spreads peanut butter chocolate wonderful stuff beginning of the new year I discovered something new that I like life doesn't get any better than that y'all take care this is Mitch Mitchell I hope to see a lot of you this year take care